that we just finished signing. Um, as most of you guys know, you know, it's kind of tough going into the situation that we're going into or that we just came from. Um, you know, being that you just got a new head coach in December, kind of short staff with some of the recruiting early that we had to do. Um, but staff came together during those January visits and during that January recruiting kind of finished up with a good signing class. Like Coach said, we were able to get guys from multiple states, which was a testament to the guys that were here recruiting, a bunch of traveling that we had to do to get that done. Um, so excited about some of the talent that we had on offense as well as defense and just the, just the speed that we added to the defense. One player that stood out, um, I know Coach was kind of talking about him too, Keith Lopez mm -hmm. um, at, at the linebacker position. What are your thoughts on, on, on him? Um, Keith Lopez is a guy that's first year playing linebacker. He's going to be a raw kid coming in just because he had not played the position that much. But he's one of those guys that has the frame, 6'5 kid, 210 right now, but can, can carry about 240, 250. Um, probably going to be a project kid a little bit early, but when he figured it out, he's going to be a tough cat to handle. So... And he, he's fast, he's a basketball player, so he has athleticism with him. So he's going to be a guy that's kind of going to be maybe a red shirt guy, if I would say, but in the future he's going to be someone to watch. Um, Y'all were already pretty solid at the defensive back position. If I'm uh -huh. not mistaken, y'all didn't lose much of not anything too, not from too that uh -huh. spot. But y'all brought in some talented and long um Athletes at that spot, how do they fit in, especially Robert McDaniel? He's one that a lot of people really have been raving about. Man, we brought in three defensive backs. And Robert McDaniel, just to speak on him, man, he's a safety. Um, actually played at Terry High School um, early in his career. Then he went over to Louisiana and played his senior year. But he's one of those guys that's going to have a chance to play at safety his first year here with us, you know, just depending on how he picks up the defense and when he first get here. But he's a guy that actually can play real well that we see. And also the two corners, um, Deshaun Baker from Tyler Town, he's one of my guys. Um, and um, Mark Eddie's from Louisiana down at Westgate, the same school as Keith Lopez. So those three guys at the defensive backfield, we believe, can actually play and potentially might have a chance to play early on. Me as a corners coach, I like to play maybe four guys. If I have five, I will play five. So those two guys coming in are coming to a good situation to be able to play if they want to. You also um, stayed with some local talent too as well, like you, you picked up uh, Jaquel Honer, who Coach also mentioned, um, coming in from Jim Hill. Um, how do you see him fitting into the defense? Um, most of the Jackson State fans uh, remember Keontae Hampton from this past year. He's going to be kind of a, one of those Keontae Hampton guys at linebacker where you can put him in the middle. He's going to run your defense. He's going to command your defense. He's going to play the right way, going to be where he's supposed to be, fit his right fits. He's going to be one of those leaders that's, that we're going to look to to kind of play for us. Who do you think most fits into what you're trying to do on the defensive side of the ball out of these signees? Um, I think they all fit. You know, that's kind of why we signed them. But uh, just to mention, too, as well, we signed a defensive lineman today, too. Devontae, like Coach said, he's going to be a guy that we, we think can come in and do some things, big kid from Alabama. Um, but all those kids, man, and also not to mention the linebacker, uh, Hudson, he's going to come in. He's going to pay the wheel for us. Um, those guys, we're expecting to come in and do some great things. What specifically were y'all looking for at the linebacker position? It seems like that was a big priority for y'all. Yeah, you know, going in, um, we only lost, like you said earlier, we didn't lose nothing in the defensive backfield. So defensive line and linebacker was kind of our big priority on defense. We lost, um, you could say, two starters at, the, at at linebacker and only one at defensive lineman. So that was a big priority for us. So we got those three guys, two guys being we, we believe they can come in and do some things. Like I said, with Lopez, he's probably going to be one of those guys who, who has to come in and put some weight on and learn the system a little more. But those other two guys, they potentially can come in and do something. Thank you. Appreciate it, Coach. Thank you. Thank <coughs> you.